What's up dudes and dudettes, my name's Seth, and today we're gonna be taking a quick little look at my Trove mod for the Chloromancer Kigurumi. That's the old one right there, the Draconis right there. So this is the Chloromancer costume. It's quite beautiful, if I do say so myself. I'm very happy with how it ended up turning out. Uh, I really, really love the look of the Chloromancer. I think that he looks like a Japanese emperor, at least in his normal costume. And uh, because of that, I ended up, like, I, I finally got time to actually make the Chloromancer costume for the Kigurumi because... I mean, seriously, man, it's just, it yeah, it was a long time coming. So it took me quite a few different tries to actually get the costume to work out, but I actually really like how it worked. And the yin yang, of course, is because you can plainly see in Team Pixel and stuff, I'm all about, you know, <laughs> those kinds of things. So for our abilities, I'm gonna show those off right here. If you do your right click, it's actually a little yin yang disc gets thrown down, and then it's a spinning top for our plants that spin around in circles and then a couple little blades that are just coming off of it just because I didn't really know what else to put on it. I guess I could have put like two hanging drums or something. Maybe move them up a little bit. I'm not sure. But either way, it's a spinning top, so it worked out. Uh, the number one ability is just a big beautiful balloon or cotton candy, one or the other. I, it's actually cotton candy. I was trying to make a balloon and it turned out like cotton candy. It's explosive cotton candy. You're gonna have to ignore the VFX that are going on right now. Uh, at the moment that I'm recording this, I have the costume replacing the Christmas costume, but it actually is going to replace the max level Chloromancer costume. I could probably have it replace the level 10 costume, but I'm not exactly sure because as you see, like there's extra pieces and parts to the costume. like. This level 10 costume actually doesn't have these wings extending out all the way. Excuse me, I'm trying to do stuff. But as you see, this one does right here. So this max level costume is what is actually replaced with the mod download. And I do, of course, have this Chloromancer costume added to my Kigurumi pack, the one that has all the different colors. So that's the one I'm gonna be rocking as soon as I'm done with this video. Otherwise, the hat, of course, is just, does it actually say? Yeah, the neon dragon crown is the one that gets replaced. And I myself am just using a crab staff or lobster staff, but all the starting staffs should be replaced by crayons. Maybe not necessarily if you end up getting the Chloromancer costume on its own, but either way, I'm happy with how it turned out, and I hope you all enjoy it as well. So thank you so much for watching, sign R, and stay epic, everybody.